this time I'd like to talk about uh, it's kind of a funny but it also uh, it's a great self-defense technique you know that was the uh, early days when I come to United States in Houston 1968 I just got the uh, after really in a hard time I finally I got my <clears throat> The green card and still I haven't uh, my family couldn't join with me at the time so uh, after the small classes so nothing to do it evening it was 1968 around November so I after the finishing class I was uh, uh, this, I decided to go to the movie theater close by downtown. A, that's Majestic Theater. It's on Main Street, the next door of the uh, Foley. So I went over there. I walked. I don't have any car, so I just walked there and stay on the line. Uh, bought a one ticket. I got in there. Then at the time. A movie between movie uh, there is uh, some um, intermission <laughs> between movie is intermission around after around 20 minute 15 20 minute intermission time and people go to the restaurant and go to the buy the popcorn and drink coca-cola then most people at that time is smoking smoking everywhere everybody liked to smoke it even myself i was smoking but the, my favorite cigarette was mm, palmal palmal red no filter it's a very strong cigarette i enjoyed it so between movie break yeah movie was the graduate uh, dustin hoffman i think he was uh he's starring that movie and he was very popular at the time. And break time, just like other people, just like others, he went out, sat down in a hallway. And I was going to smoking cigarette. Then I just get the, my cigarette in my mouth. I would look around everywhere, but I couldn't find my uh, lighter and the matches I couldn't find it so I see the one young man is it's white it's a good-looking young you know like my age young man is sit down in front of me in the hallway so he was smoking so I looking at him I asked him may I borrow a light from you so he ignored me he didn't say anything act like he doesn't hear anything so I asked him again may I have a light from you and I just even <laughs> used my hand and I tried to, to explain it you know and he keep looking at me he didn't say anything so uh, well I feel like uh, I think this guy is uh, trying to insult me I think uh, racial problem you know it's, Then he just pick it up, a uh, match, small uh, paper match, paper, what do you call it? They open it up and just people look, open it. And he's smoking. So he gave it to me. So I tried to get it from him. He sit down just like, where are you at? I sit down here. I just go try to get this match. Then he trying to give it to me middle of me <laughs> he just dropped that cigarette you know, dropped the match it surprised me he didn't give it to me he just dropped it on the floor so well I think I think this this guy you know tried to insult me but I need to still I need to smoke I didn't say anything I pick it up match I light it up, 
Then I uh, smoking. Then after that, thank you. I hand it to him again. In the middle of I just dropped it on the floor, like like he did. I think he got really surprised at what I did. He he didn't pick it up. He keep looking at me. Then he just he stood up and just walked away. Well, that was a uh, right timing. It was the right timing. So uh, if I in that situation, it's easy to get kind of a uh, get in trouble with each other, you know. But that was a uh, that was my experiences at the time.